of legendary artist Satish Kujral has to be influenced by her father in some way or the other. And now an exclusive peek at Miss Kujral's Royal Jewellery Collection. This coral set that you're seeing, the necklace, if you notice, the, the way the coral and the polki are set is again set in the old Kundan traditional style and it's called the Pachi setting. And the drop on the earring is again the a style of setting which was done in the old Hyderabadi jewellery. The outer layer is uh, the polkis and the diamonds are set in silver. So it is traditional and yet it is very contemporary. This uh, necklace that you see is set again in Polki and if you see the reverse side of this piece has got the traditional Meenakari on it. The form is not traditional at all but the style again is uh, Mughal setting, it is all uh, Kundan and it's set with blue stones which again is something which breaks away a little from the tradition as the Indian jewellery has very little blue in it, uh, the old jewellery. But the polki is, yes, very, very, very much traditional. This piece that you see is again traditional, but I've really, really contemporized it. As you can see, I've put this piece of jarao, which is on a huge mother of pearl. And then I've used the old traditional gold beads, which you see in the damru form. Then the, there are pieces again, which are emerald and uh, kundan and then here again I've tried to use different shades of emerald rather than the typical dark green which is there in every traditional piece of jewellery. So this particular piece that you're seeing is the traditional Navratan as in the nine planet stones which uh, in the old days the royalty wore it as the modern day evil eye and it was worn to ward off the evil eye, ruby being the essentially the main stone always in the Navratan. This piece that she's wearing is the traditional Chandwala and it's a little bit of modern forms in it, but yes, it is the traditional Mughal Chandwala. This is again set with pole keys and the pearls are Basra pearls. And the bangle that goes with this is again a traditional Mughal bangle which is uh, set with enamel work with emeralds and gold. 